Hey guys, I'm the Sonic Shuffle, and welcome to another episode of Spyro Heroes Tale. On the last episode, we talked to this elder guy and um, destroyed our first dark gem. We also learned a few basics of the game. So, um, something I want to point out. Uh, this elder, I mean, like, every elder you come to, because there's more than one, every elder you go to is going to give you an upgrade of some kind. An upgrade, and it could be, like, an upgrade usually in like any um, battle tactics or something like that to help you progress through the game. I wouldn't say like battle tactics uh, specifically. I don't know why I was doing that. Anyway, so we can come up here and we see a new character. Who is it? <laughs> hey! Yo, Spyro, did you know you can use the double jump to glide further? So, double jump and glide already, buddy. If you find a dragon egg and get back here safely, I'll open the door. Okay, yeah, 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 we know. Um, so, yeah, that's how you glide. You just double tap A, and then you just glide. Oh, well, double tap A and then hold it the second time. You glide. Um, so, yeah, let's actually go down here and get a whole bunch of gems uh, while I explain some stuff. So, um... As you can see, that was a cheetah, and his name is Hunter. And Hunter, um, Hunter's first appearance was in uh, Spyro 2: Ripto's Rage, or Gateway to Glimmer if you're from Europe. And uh, what's funny is they actually got Ripto from the Japanese, the the look of the Japanese spelling of Spyro. So, um, yeah, that's actually pretty interesting. Um. Another thing about the earlier Spyro games compared to this game is that the earlier Spyro games and shut up Trina. The earlier Spyro games <laughs> were made by Insomniac Games and they were the original creators of Spyro. They created the first Spyro trilogy which is known for being the best Spyro games out of the series. Um however, they only had a contract with um Universal Studios, the game studios they work for. Um well, let's actually zoom in really quick with the C stick, whatever. Um, so they actually m only had a contract with them for three die birds for three games, and uh, after that they kind of just left and created more games, but they never just came back to Spyro. So, um, Universal Studios took it upon themselves to create games like this and um, this is actually the only good game they actually made out of this Spyro series. The game before this Spyro Enter the Dragonfly was notorious for being a bad game just because of the fact that Spyro uh, Enter the Dragonfly well you know what if you just look up a review of it and you'll know I'll probably explain it later but yeah for now let's just keep it at that it's just a bad game overall and um, yeah I mean, it's it's really sad that Universal Studios couldn't make any more games, but you know, it's it, it is what it is, I guess. Um, so continuing on, this is a bomb. Like I said in episode one, you can shoot bombs. Uh, you don't have to aim like this, but you can press L to aim and then press R to shoot the bomb. Um, so yeah, that'll kill enemies really fast and uh, you'll get more bombs later on the max you can hold for right now the max bombs you can hold is, or, is 10 bombs and uh, uh, anyway um actually the the enemies in Spyro are actually very famous for their mechanics um, they they wait for you to come to them to attack they don't come to you and attack and that's actually a, a very very different mechanic um See, the reason why that works out so well is because, um, by the way, that was a rocket. You just burn the rocket, it shoots at one of these things, and then it'll, it'll break the chest because you can't break it normally like the other ones. Um, <clears throat> well, let's talk to Hunter, I guess, hey, again. nice one, Spyro. You managed to find the dragon egg. All right. Keep it safe. Somebody might be looking for that. Oh, now allow me to get the door. And unnecessary archery accepted. Um, but yeah, if you if you recall, 
In the earlier Spyro games, and I'm sorry I'm comparing it so much, but in the earlier Spyro games, uh, Hunter was actually not an archer at all. He was just a cheetah. <laughs> he was just a cheetah. Just a badass cheetah. I don't, I don't really know how to explain it any other way. Um, so there's really nothing in this water at all. Uh, you can't open that chest without a lockpick, and sadly we haven't been visited a store or anything yet, so... Uh, let's actually... Like I said, they wait for you to come to them. They, they don't ever move, they don't ever do anything of that sort. They wait for you to come to them. And that's actually a very interesting mechanic, as I said before, but actually let's get this rock and I can... I can just get some... Some more gems. Some more gems. Let's burn these trees. Bonsai! I'm like that old granny from Hoodwinked. Um, so... I actually have never seen Hoodwink 2. Die, sheep! Sheep! Come here. Okay, I'm sorry. I was just like, I needed to get sparks to gold again. And let's talk to the professor. Spyro, this is an activation pad for my latest invention. The ball gadget. The ball gadget. I'm operate, sorry. You, need to collect eight <laughs> you just put, like, so much empathy. Stars. Never Emphasis on that. <laughs> oh. uh, then how about red coins? No? Heart pieces? Gold tokens? I'm at a loss, Spyro. Uh, what exactly do you need to collect? Uh, I don't know. Light gems? Fine. You need eight light gems. Anyway, off you go. I'll open the door to the nursery for you. The cameos are so the real. Gems. Approach the pad. Dude, the cameos are so real. He said power stars, red coins. He just made a, a reference references to uh, Mario and um and Legend of Zelda. Oh my god, that was so bad. Stop, please! Stop right there! Hey, what's going on here? It's those thieves again. They've just stolen the last of my dragon eggs. Dragon eggs? Oh, yeah, I found one of those. Maybe I can find all the dragon eggs for you. You know, I'm gonna be out saving the world anyway. Well, at my last count, there were 80 of them. Ten eggs to a set. If you can find whole sets, I'm sure you'll be rewarded. How could you have 80 eggs? What are you, a spider? Jeez, I don't, I don't even understand. Anyway, let's collect our first <laughs> light gem. And oh my god, it feels so good to collect light gems. You don't even understand. Anyway, there are a hundred light gems. There are 80 dragon eggs and a freaking spider dragon. And uh, I'm gonna beat you up like... <laughs> like Billy from Billy, Billy and Mandy. That's really funny. Um, if, you, if you remember, he hates spiders so much. And like his quote-unquote son is a spider. But anyway, if, you, if you're young, you might not get that, but... Yeah, let's just keep going. Um, so you can actually go into Moneybag Shop again. And let's actually get something before we go free to browse somewhere else. Um, wares, we can get this thing, Maligger, um, right there. We actually don't need to spend our money on anything else right now. We'll come back and talk about those later when we get the chance. Um, but I actually want to go back and get something that um, some people forget, some people remember, but yeah, whatever. I'm remembering it, so it really doesn't matter. So yeah. We just got our second dragon egg already, and how many gems do we have, actually? Oh, we have a, we have a decent amount of gems already, so... We're actually gonna go buy two things, um... From the shop, and I don't know why I didn't just buy it, I don't know why, but... We're gonna come back and explain some stuff. Um, ah, so, my favorite wallet. we can come to Moneybag Store and buy things. This is a firebomb. We already have one of those, though. Uh, we don't really need any more. Uh, I don't actually use them that much, but if you're in a, in a sitch, you can, uh, you can use those. You can buy a whole magazine oh, for 50 gems, which you can, uh, oh yeah, yeah, you can carry five or more of those. Um, but yeah. Like I said, I think the total you can, you can, the total firebombs you can get is like, uh, like 10. 
So let's actually buy another one of these, and um, I'll explain everything else in the store later, but um, this is to get double valued gems, and I actually want this right now, because we're actually going to get a whole bunch of gems, and uh, so you get two times as much gems for a certain amount of time. So let's, let me explain something else real quick, dude. No, no, I actually don't have to explain anything else. I explained everything, so. Did you just hear that? That was weird. That was really weird. It sounded like he was having an orgasm or something. Um, but yeah, let's get this chest really quick. And it actually had a light gem. That's why I told you to get the chest. Um, yeah, let's get a whole bunch of gems. We're gonna get a whole bunch, man. Uh, you don't even understand. Uh, so, I don't know if those guys are wearing, like, boxers or whatever. Like, I don't, I don't even know. I don't know why I say whatever all the time. It's just a thing. They are, make sure you collect all these gems before you talk to anybody, including that penguin over there with a jetpack. I know, I know, he's pretty interesting, but no. Not right now. Actually, let's get this. So... Break through that wall. Keep getting these things. We're about to have more gems than we had ever. And get this dragon egg. The third dragon egg in the game. And actually, on that topic, I actually want to say, uh, if you guys really want me to create like a video, um, videos like that have like maps on them. And, like, I could put, like, links showing where the dragon eggs are specifically, like, light gems and stuff like that. Uh, the collectibles in this game. And, uh, whenever you hear that sound, you can get a light gem. So, that is cool. Um, but, yeah. No, I don't want to talk to you! Spyro, you found the secret entrance to my What are you drawing? Well, I'm busy right now, so let me show you the not-so-secret exit. The not so wow. How rude. I'm making so many references, you don't even understand. Alright, um. So, let's collect a few more gems going over here because. Oh god, no, 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 no. We're gonna run out, we're gonna run out. Before we do that, though, before we end this episode off, let's get this dark gem. And yeah, um. That's it for this episode, and I'll see you guys on the next episode of Spyro Heroes Tale. I'm the Sonic Shuffle, and I'm out.